Welcome to this first look at the new look of Powertrax Pro Audio 9. This new version of PG Music's popular MIDI and digital audio sequencer makes it easier and more fun for you to get serious about making music on your computer. For a start, these floating dockable toolbars can easily be customized to show just the buttons you want. And you can move the toolbars to the position on the screen that suits you the best. We're looking at the new tracks window and now we'll load a song to see if you agree that this is likely to become your favorite workspace. Every track has an overview that shows either a piano roll view of MIDI events or if it's an audio track, the overview of the audio waveform. These overviews not only make it easy to follow what's happening in your song, it's also easy to select a section of one or several tracks for editing. In the track name panel to the left, you'll see that all general MIDI instruments are labeled with colorful eye-catching icons that make it easy to identify tracks at a glance. The track name field tells us the track name, the MIDI patch, and the MIDI output port. And there's a mute button that shows a green check when the track is active and a red X when the track is muted. A right mouse click on the track name field opens a selection dialog for instrument patches and MIDI port assignments. Now select any general MIDI patch and its icon will appear on the screen. Now we can adjust the volume and the panning for any track with these convenient sliders. And by clicking this disclosure arrow, we can also make changes to effect settings such as reverb, and chorus, or we could adjust the velocity of the MIDI notes, transpose the MIDI notes, and loop the track. Powertrax Pro Audio 9 supports DirectX instruments, better known as DXI software synthesizers, so you can click the Edit DXI button to choose your favorite DXI synth for the track. Or you can add real time. DirectX audio effects from PG Music or any other DirectX effects that you have installed on your computer. In this song, we've used the option to assign the default DXI synth to all tracks, so the Ederol VSC DXI synth is already assigned as the MIDI output port for this track. We could use the remaining slots in the DirectX window to apply real-time effects like echo or reverb to the output of the assigned DXI synth. Powertrax Pro Audio 9 also has great new features for audio recording. So next we'll look at an audio track. If we wanted to record an audio track we could use the new silent count-in feature but since our audio track has already been recorded we don't need the count-in but this feature would also be useful for a live performance. We can see from the track overview that this is an audio track, but it hasn't been identified as a particular audio track type or category. By category, we mean a guitar track or a keyboard track or vocal track. We can choose a category to assign an icon for the track and also to apply a preset group of the effects that are commonly used for that audio category. In fact, Powertrax Pro Audio 9 also allows you to use your own photos for track icons, and you can also associate your own preset effects with your personalized photo icons. So that means that the track button could show a picture of your singer or, say, your own guitar, and also load your favorite effect setup to go with it. This track is a male vocal track, and we'll choose to load the preset effects that go with it, but we don't need to activate the effects just yet. Before we do, we'll play the track without audio effects. Listen to the voice that fills your mind. Now we'll use this handy button to apply the audio effects and listen again, and this time we'll use the silent count-in feature. Listen to the voice that fills your mind Listen, just listen, and you'll find 
Now we come to the amazing new Audio Harmonies feature. Using the industry-leading TC Helicon technology included in Powertracks Pro Audio 9, we'll now add Audio Harmonies to our vocal track by clicking on the Harmonies button. In the Generate Audio Harmonies dialog, you'll see that there are three different ways to use this powerful feature. Melody pitch tracking means that the audio track is aligned to the pre-recorded notes in a designated MIDI track. So if, for example, that track is the melody of your song, then the audio track will be perfectly aligned to the pitch of the MIDI notes in the melody. You can also use this mode to double an audio track, or you could even change the notes on the audio track to match new notes that you have edited onto the MIDI track. A second mode generates multi-part harmonies from multiple MIDI tracks. An obvious use of this mode would be where you have imported a Band in a Box MIDI file that includes Band in a Box harmony parts. The Powertracks Pro Audio Harmonies feature will create new audio tracks from the MIDI harmony tracks. The third option is to harmonize your audio track with audio harmonies that are based on the chord changes of the song. You can see the chord changes in the chords window. And if your MIDI file doesn't include the chord symbols, that's not a problem. Powertracks Pro Audio will write the chord symbols for you with its incredibly clever chord wizard feature. Now let's choose a harmony type. And we'll specify that we want each harmony to be output on its own audio track. The four above setting for our male vocalist will add a four-piece vocal backup group. When the TC Helicon dialog opens, you'll see that it offers several advanced options for fine-tuning the sound of your harmony ensemble, whether it's a vocal group or a brass section. Now let's hear the harmonies created by Powertracks Pro Audio 9 with its TC Helicon technology. Listen to the voice that fills your mind. Listen, just listen, and you'll find Answers you didn't have before And as you listen more and more The world doesn't seem to be the bad dream you thought it would be The harmony tracks are identified with their own icons we could change these to use any of the available track categories and add preset effects, or since we put each harmony on its own track, we could add effects in the Powertracks Pro Audio 9 mixer window. The mixer window has been enlarged to show 24 tracks in a row. On a high resolution monitor, you see two rows with all 48 tracks. The new insert button will insert the current mixer track settings into the events list for all tracks in use. And the delete button can be used to remove them again. There are also new keystrokes to quickly mute and unmute tracks. There's lots more to see and hear in Powertracks Pro Audio 9, like new bass, ukulele, mandolin, and banjo fretboards in the guitar window, as well as tablature in the notation for these instruments. The new punch-in mode makes it easy to select any location and record without leaving the main screen. There's lots going on under the hood too, like the ability to embed SysX events in MIDI tracks, silky smooth DirectX audio rendering, ultra high note resolution and fail-safe recording features so that you never lose a take or accidentally record over an existing track. The best way to fully appreciate the new Powertracks Pro Audio 9 is to use it. To get your own copy of this exciting new version of Powertracks Pro Audio, you can go shopping right now on the PG Music website at www.pgmusic.com and you'll be downloading Powertracks Pro Audio 9 in minutes. And of course, Powertracks Pro Audio 9 comes with the unbeatable PG Music 30-day, no-hassle, money-back guarantee. 
So go ahead and order your copy now.